Hello and welcome to the third and final part on this little series on the broomstick lace edging. I uh, realize some people might be wondering where the pattern is from. It is from this little booklet called Learn Tatting by J and P Coates. It's book number 660. Um, the purpose of the video was actually was not to give you a specific pattern, but just to um, show you new ideas, perhaps inspire you to try something different with your tatting. So this was the second round. And this is how the third round has turned out, which I'm very pleased with. And here's the corner. And I have actually changed the corner. This is not the original pattern. I didn't like the way it looked in the original, so I have designed my own. So I'll just quickly show you how the last round is worked. The nice thing about this edging also is that it's all chains, so you can work it all with just one, one ball of thread and one shuttle. And you don't need to keep rewinding your shuttle because it's it's all made with chains. So it's just two uh, stitches between the, the the repeats on the sides. And then a chain of two stitches with three picots and three stitches. Two, three. Two, three. This is joined. This is the joining to the center part here. Just look at the center of the repeat. And what was interesting about this is that although this looks like a ring, it is also made. Um, it's also a chain that is just joined back onto itself to make it look like a ring. So it's three stitches again. Three picots. And three more stitches. And you just join it back in the same picot where you started your chain. I always make sure I snug my chain quite tightly so it's got a nice, no floppiness. Complete the join and then make the next chain. And two more stitches to complete this chain, the last chain of this repeat. And then you're back to the short chain between repeats. So it's quite easy. It's uh, quite fast to, sh to work, really. And I think the result is pretty. So there you go. I hope you'll fancy trying something different. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.